Today I'm down in the uh, Torquay with the English Riviera Centre staff and Lifestyles Fitness Centre. Colin Pemberton is a long time Wabba supporter and actually I've known Colin for too many years. Colin, <laughs> Colin how many years is it since we first well, knew each other? You must be around 25, 26 years. You've 20, been coming to, the, years. Yeah, been coming to the Riviera. How long have you been here, Paul? I've been here 27 years. And um, like I say, a couple of years after that, I think I've done my first uh, course Wabba with course, yeah, course yeah. with yourself. Yeah. Um, like I say, it's helped me along the way yeah. you know, extremely. Yeah. Like I say, I started off. You were mopping floors when I first knew you. You was a lifeguard who was doing part time work and a bit of cleaning work. Yeah. That's right, I started as a lifeguard and I, I moved across into the uh, gym, de gym department. Yeah. And then that's when I, I met yourself, we done the, the, yeah. the Wabba course, and there was me and a few colleagues. And then from there, like I say, <laughs> Say because then you was a senior, involved. you was an instructor with us, and then a senior instructor, yeah. PT, and then you was a, a supervisor here next week. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. Become a supervisor, and uh, and then the leisure manager left, and then I put myself forward for, for that for, for the uh, manager's job, and then obviously I've been a manager now for what, 10, 12 years. And 12 years yeah. for Lifestyles Fitness Centre. For Lifestyles yeah. Fitness Centre, and it was, I, mean, I don't even remember a long time ago, the gym was you know, quite small. It was tiny. When we first met, there was half a dozen stations, a couple of sets of dumbbells, and I think one bench, and that was it. Whereas today you're yeah, yeah, expanding it massively. Yeah, we had about 15 stations, but now we've got about 60 stations, like I say. But, I mean, not just that, the facility, we've got a dance studio, we've got a cardio side studio, we've got a wet facilities as well, so like I say, in the in the years we've been obviously been working built together, it it's built up, yeah. and and not only that, I mean we've had you know like I say nearly every instructor's come through the WABA yeah. training regime, and, and we've had some, they do a great job, don't they? Yeah, well, we've had some great staff over the years. It's yeah. just like I say, keeping all of them sometimes difficult because once they get a bit of a reputation and they build the reputation here, then they go off and do their own PT thing. That's right. The person so train some more of them. Then. No, well the person training, as you know now, is one of the you know, in the industry now is one of the you know, biggest things out there and, and the only good thing is with the person training, people have got potential to stay in the industry now because they can earn more money. Yeah. So, but yeah, I mean, trying to keep them staff is difficult because they say they get their own clientele. You're not paying them I mean, enough, uh, Cole, no, that's, that's what right, it is. Right. They don't want more money, mate. <laughs> oh, you stop running these PT courses. <laughs> So you, you think that um, in the future it will still keep growing more and more? Do, do you think the way it's going? Hopefully, I mean, obviously we're looking for investment, but yeah, yeah I mean, it, yeah. like I say, you know, the, the industry obviously is getting bigger and big, bigger and bigger. There's more competition. It's just like you say, we've got to try and keep ahead of the competition and not be complacent really. And like you say, you know, the, I, I'm, a, I'm a big believer in, you know, the facility is only as good as its staff and that's yeah. why, you know, doing you know, training with the, you know, the lab away and you know, getting Good Again, you want to say the same yeah, thing yeah, all the time. Thing. And that's what the biggest thing we do surveys yeah. for the facilities and, and the biggest thing that comes out of it is the staff. You know what I mean? At the end of the day there's, there's other gyms in the area that have got nicer facilities, yeah. but they keep coming here because because the staff like are so staff. friendly and they like the staff. And they're knowledgeable and they give them what, what they want. And you know we've always said the same thing, Cole, since we first met years years ago, you were saying it's 26 years ago. Results brings customers back. And why the trainers get results? Your staff here have always given the clients the results that they wanted, and they keep coming back, don't they? And they just come back for year after year to keep getting those results and maintaining it. That's the key to success, really. I think. I think that is one of the biggest keys to success. Is what I've always said on any of the courses that we do. If the staff get results for the clients, the clients will keep coming back, and that's one of the most important things. Well, definitely. I mean, we've got two of our. Um, Personal trainers here who, who work, work here. They're, they're actually freelance, but they work here at the centre. Yeah. The two most successful ones, Daniel and John Sims, are, are both yeah. personal trainers through Wabba. Well yeah. And the client base they've got, we do retain you know, a hell of a lot of members just through, through them using our facility. So, yeah. yeah. I mean, even though I do lose them as staff, they're still here. Yeah. You know, say a as a member. And a presence here. Yeah. yeah. And because obviously part of their personal training agreement is that the people have got to be members. Yeah. And it works hand in hand. But like you say, you know, the main reason they, they, they keep here is because they're reaching the targets and getting to the goals. I think that is so important because then that con continuity it builds a sort of a, a friendship base that the customers all know 
and they recognise the faces of the trainers, don't they? And they get to know them. And once they've been with a trainer for a while, they feel very comfortable with someone. And it, it actually, it's quite a change. It's quite hard to change and then have a different trainer. And, and a trainer starts to build up a, quite a good client base and gets the regular bookings every week, then all the time, which, which makes a massive difference as well. And, and that's the other good thing as well. Is, is is here we have a good retention of staff as well, even though I said I've lost a few good ones, but Martin, who's my supervisor, who again, he was a, he's a WABA trainer, and we've got, like I said, Daniel, John, who is still here, John does a couple of shifts, but his personal training is his main point. So a lot of staff have been here 10 years plus, so that helps you know, retain membership as well. I can't actually remember how many courses we've done here, but the people that have done here, we've done hundreds, haven't we, over we've the done years. Hundreds of staff have come from, and, and you mostly have you, come from the south. You're west. mostly fine, in, in, even though you know the competitors, but you, you mostly look locally. All the hotels, the, gym, the gyms, the hotels. I'd say the majority of their staff would have done their training courses through through here yeah. at the Riviera Centre. So like, yeah. yeah. Yeah, it's great to have a big impact in it. I, I remember the first time that I came down to Torquay, I was bewildered by the amount of hotels. When I first came in into the town on the road in, I couldn't believe the amount of hotels. And over the years, it's gone from one hotel having a little fitness suite to lots and lots of them all having them. And ironically, all of the staff from those centres all came here for the Wabba course to do the training here which says a great thing about our partnership together. Oh, definitely, yeah. I mean, the only downside to it is the chipping away at my membership. <laughs> <laughs> and you, you, want, you, want them, you want them not to take your members. That's right, yeah. 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 But, like you say, it's just part of the beast with leisure, you know yeah. what I mean? Like, so it's getting bigger and bigger. Yeah. But, like you say, you are right. You, know, you look around, or, I mean, I go to some of these centres and most of the guys have come through the courses that have been yeah. run here. So. Yeah, well, at least we know that they're building a good name and they're doing a de decent job out there and hopefully looking after their clients, yeah, which is important uh, for us, with our other name, but important with the Riviera Centre because of our long-term partnership anyway, yeah, as well, yeah. which is so important. Oh yeah, like so, I say, for us, it's been, you know, the relationship over the years has helped me, not just on that, I mean, I remember I've employed a few people, I've asked you for, a ref you guys run the courses, you know what I mean, yeah. you know we would fit in. You know, like, which helps as well. Like yeah. a guy that you know would fit in. Like, Alan, you know, did so and so get on the course? Yeah. Yeah. You know, you know, so you, you, you can give me all this. Give me the right yeah. personality. Yeah. The personality. The right would fit in with my, you know, like, with your team. Team, like, yeah. yeah. So it yeah. works that way as well. Yeah. So, yeah. Definitely. Well, I hope that we have another twenty odd years to go. Yeah. I don't know if I'll be retired <laughs> by then. You will as well. But we'll try our best. Yeah. And Never um, we'll have another twenty plus years of uh, Wabba doing it with the Riviera Centre down in Torquay. It's the biggest leisure centre in the southwest of England. I've enjoyed my time coming here for 26 years, as Colin has told me today. I thought it was less than that. I must be getting old. So, fantastic, Colin. Look forward to another 20 plus well, years doing it again. It's a pleasure. Cheers, Colin. Cheers, Colin. Bye.